Hello everyone, today we're at the Discraft Factory. It's spring in Michigan. We got a lot of cool things we're working on. Today, we want to give you a little insight on what some of those things are that are available, what are things that are coming out, future things we're working on, all kinds of cool stuff. This is all things based on your feedback, things that you're looking for from Discraft. We're always listening to you guys. You're the lifeline that keeps us going and we really appreciate you. And it's all about you. So let's go check it out. All right, let's go in. The first thing I'm gonna tell you about is the Discraft Factory store. One thing that our fans are always asking is, we need better pricing, we need good deals. Let's see the deals again. It's been a few years where we haven't had a lot of deals. We're gonna bring back the factory store the way it used to be. 10 packs, five packs, miscellaneous misprints, testers. A lot of these discs are lightly blemished, didn't quite hold up to the standards for our retailers. Something you could pick up for your friends, family, someone you're trying to get into disc golf. Affordable option just to try new molds before you invest into a certain mold. We're gonna have open box items on there. Uh, like I said, there will be testers. Right now we have the Z Venoms on there. We were testing those out. We wanted to give those to the fans and we didn't know where to put those. So there's some exclusive offers on there. Did I mention the pricing? The pricing is amazing right now. If you go to factorystore.discraft.com, right now you can check out that pricing. Limited time, a lot of that stuff is on sale for the grand opening basically but as you can see we got a lot of stuff we're making and it's all because you guys have been asking for the deals the hookups the misprints check out that website let us know what you think all right so another cool offering that we have coming soon is we're gonna offer something for the dying community we begin a lot of requests for white discs that are blank on top. These will be bottom stamped. We're gonna have Buzz, Roach, and Nuke. All three of these we're gonna start with, and we're gonna see what the dying community thinks of these. If they work, how they like them, all that. We're actually testing them right now to make sure that they do work and they are up to your standards. So we're gonna come over here to the dying station. I'm gonna show you some cool stuff we have. Hey Bob, how's it going? What's up, Mike? Oh, not too much, man. Just uh, checking out these new discs, seeing how they take dye, and so far, I gotta say I'm impressed. You did a good job. So to give you a kind of an idea, we've actually been doing some spin dyes on the record player, uh, a little bit of clear glue and lotion dyes. Uh, both seem to be really vibrant, kind of hold that color and hold a lot of the detail. Nice thing about these two is because they're bottom stamps, you can use the whole canvas. You can do whatever you want, top and bottom. And it seems like they uh, do stencil work really well. So really, the only limit is your imagination. All right, I'm very excited to let you know about this next new offering that Discraft has. It's probably the most requested item that we've had in a long time, more than I can remember. We get hit up about this all the time. Why don't you have more lightweight discs? Well, guess what? We're bringing back Z-Lite. Discs all the way down to 140, 150 grams still have the stability, new and improved, a brand new stamp. The plastic feels great. I'm not gonna lie, these look way better than the first time we did Z-Lite. They feel better. This is gonna be coming out in 2023. We're doing everything we can to get at least four to eight molds available soon. But right now, this is the first one that we have finalized. This is the final prototype with the new stamp and what it's gonna look like. Okay, okay. I know what you're thinking. There's no way there's more. We already talked about all this great stuff. Z-Lite, dyeable discs for the dyeing community, the factory store being revamped with new, better prices. What else could there be that the fans have been asking for the last couple years? How about the Ace Race? In front of me on this table, I have past Ace Race discs. These were all prototype molds when they were in the Ace Race form. These, are, these were before they came out as a stock release. Some of these never even came out as a stock release, like the Zeppelin. We didn't get the feedback that we wanted. We weren't quite happy with it, so we never released it. But we have great discs like the Focus, the Nebula. The Heat, the Heat's a fan favorite, and that was an Ace Race disc at one time. So in 2024, we will come out with a new mold. It'll be a prototype, and you fans will be able to test it in the Ace Race. Here we are, the end of the video. We talked about a lot of cool things, and the purpose of this video was to show you all the unique things that we have coming out in 2023, 2024, but also to let you know as fans, you do have a voice, we are listening to you, and we're always doing whatever we can to make your guys' game much better. So we appreciate all the feedback, support, positivity that you've offered us over the last 40 plus years, and uh, I'm sure there's 20 years of other things I could talk about, but for now, that's enough for this video. And just know that we're gonna keep innovating our brand, the sport, and the offerings that we bring to you. We appreciate it. Thank you. 
Have a great day.